What's up guys, it's Jose Zuniga. So for today's video, we're gonna be going over 12 style essentials that should be in every man's closet. I get it all the time. If you're a beginner or finally actually starting to care about your style and wanna know what are the 12 essential pieces that every man should have in their closet, Today you're gonna find out. So this is a lot, so we're gonna go quick through them. Number one, tailored sweatpants. Sweatpants are no longer a sign that you gave up on life. If they fit properly, you can compose comfortable, stylish, athleisure looks all day, any day. If the situation permits, of course. Number two, the bomber jacket. It is arguably one of the most versatile styles of outerwear a man can own. It fits and suits almost every body type and can be worn for three out of the four seasons of the year. Number three is a great crew neck sweater. I call this the perfect in-between icebreaker piece. Let's say it's chilly outside enough to layer but not enough to wear a jacket. Wear a great crew neck. Or you want to dress formal but not wear a full suit because you fear it's gonna be a little bit too much. Wear a great crew neck sweater. Number four, White sneakers. Plain and simple, they're timeless, they work with everything, and they're just a no-brainer. That's why almost every brand has their own iteration of it. Following that one, number five is the white dress shirt. You name me one outfit that you can't compose with a white dress shirt. Go ahead. That's right, you can't. That's why you should definitely own one, and as you can see, I actually own multiple. That's how important they are. This particular one you see me wearing is one of the sharpest ones that I own and it's from a store called Taylor Store. Taylor Store delivers custom fit clothing right to your door starting for around 60 bucks. And the best part is that they have an enormous selection of fabrics. So yes, you are getting a custom made garment just specifically for you for the price that you would pay in a department store for something off the rack. And how it works is surprisingly super simple. First, you go through their list of fabrics. Like I said, they have tons, so you have a lot to choose from. Once you choose that fabric, you enter their 3D designer. I think this was probably the most fun part. This was the best part. They have so many different options and styles that you can choose from. You'll probably be there just playing around with the designer for hours to see all the different styles you can compose. Once you've nailed down the style, the specific style that you want for you, then you just submit three measurements. That's it. Takes you about a minute and you're done. And after that, in a couple weeks, you're gonna get a shirt delivered to your door that requires no tailoring to it whatsoever and that fits perfectly for the price that you would pay for something off the rack. And little secret, I got you a discount code. So not only will it be cheaper, but if you get the shirt and it doesn't fit, they have a fit guarantee that they will remake that shirt and make sure it fits perfect or give you credit to allow you to tailor it at your local tailoring shop. So if you guys want to start developing a tailored wardrobe, definitely check out Taylor Store. Like I said, this is one of the essentials you need to own. So you want to make sure you get it right off the bat and not buy something cheap or something that doesn't fit. If you want something quality made and that's going to fit straight out of the box that needs no tailoring, definitely check out Taylor Store. I'm going to have them linked down below. The sixth item that you're going to need is obviously a good t-shirt. Personally, I'd opt for a crew neck. V-necks were popping a couple years back, but now crew necks are making a comeback. They're classic, they look great, and if it fits good, you can compose almost any style. You can even throw a jacket over it or just wear it by itself. Number seven, of course a watch. It doesn't matter if it's super expensive or super affordable. Nothing is more elegant than wearing a watch as opposed to having to look at your phone all the time. Number eight, chucker boots. I've talked about these before. The great thing with chucker boots is not only are they right now in style for fall and winter, but this is the style of boot that you can wear year round. You can wear it through spring and summer. Out of all the boot styles, if you ask me what is the first boot I should buy, I'd probably say the chucker boot. Number eight, the casual button down. You're not always going to want to wear a dress shirt, but you might not want to look too casual in a t-shirt. That in between is a casual button down. All you need to make sure is that it's cropped shorter and it usually can come in an Oxford or some sort of plaid or flannel. Again, like these from Taylor Store. These specific fabrics I personally designed more casual, so I made sure they were cropped. I decided to edit a button down feature, etc. That's the great thing with Taylor Store. So if you like any of these designs or the white dress shirt, again, they're going to be linked down below. And go onto the 3D designer for free and design your own shirt. Once you've chosen all the things, if you like what you design, 
you can go ahead and buy it and if you like it there's gonna be a discount code so you can get it even cheaper number 10 are obviously a good pair of jeans if it's only gonna be one pair always go dark you don't want to go light you don't want to go black you don't want to go wash and make sure that they're a straight or slim cut that has no tears rips or distressing this is a pair that you can wear all the time without people knowing it's your only pair so you want to make sure they're not as memorable and they fit right number 11 chino shorts you're not always going to be wearing pants chino shorts are by far the answer go with khaki or navy if it's your first one or both because these are both staples that you're going to be wearing through spring and summer and finally number 12 at least one sharp cut suit even if you're a young guy i say if you're plus 18 you should own at least one sharp cut suit in your wardrobe and the older you get the more you can buy all right guys so that's it for today's video i hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, don't forget to check out our sponsor, Taylor Store. They're going to be linked down below. That's it for me today. See you next time.